All right, uh, so the Knicks players can finally get some rest. The injuries were just too yeah. much. I think Josh Hart got injured, OG was injured, and then Brunson fractured his hand at the end there. Yeah. Uh, so they have a super, they have their superstar in Jalen Brunson and a good supporting cast and a lot of assets. Yep. So with that said, LeBron James to the Knicks next year? God, I'd love it. I mean, it would be awesome. I don't think it's going to happen. Uh, I I think it is on the board, but not at all likely in the least. I think it's possible. I think he would fill a massive need for them. Um, they need another piece. They obviously should spam the Suns phone calling for Kevin Durant. I understand a lot of folks want Mikhail Bridges because he's the Nova guy and it at if I'm being honest, I don't think the Knicks are a Mikhail Bridges away from being champions. I think then you yeah. have this awesome <laughs> roster, but you don't have the right. guy. Well, J- listen, Jalen Brunson has made himself the guy, but if he's going to be your guy, you need a better number two than Mikhail Something Bridges. Something heftier, you know, right. R- right, e- yeah. exactly. Uh, I do want to talk about the injuries, though, because I think people are being so intellectually dishonest about the Tibbs piece of it which is folks are acting like because of what the injuries were that Tibbs playing his guys these insane minutes has nothing to do with the injuries. And that just, that defies the obvious logic and the most basic point of this. Are you more likely to suffer a basketball-related injury when you're playing basketball or not? On the bench? Right. Yeah, I see here. Yeah, like people are like, oh, well, only OGs was an overuse injury. Yeah. But I, and so this was the analogy that I I used uh, on the show uh, that I'm going to use again. If I run a delivery business, okay? a courier business in New York City. And my business is known for working my guys incredibly long hours, having them run or do more deliveries than any other company, and I don't give them water breaks. And at the end of the year, I've had I've lost 10 couriers to injury or other. And and I'm like, "Well, hold on a second, yeah, guys." Do. Only two of them was dehydration. Exactly. The other seven got hit by cars or turned an ankle. You can't say that's on me. It's like, well, no, but they had more opportunities to get run over by uh, somebody on an e-bike because they were out in the streets more. There are more opportunities for these guys to get hurt because of the minutes they're playing. And if I to use take the Tibbs analogy further... If every year I ran this business around September, people wrote articles like, oh my goodness, Nick's delivery business overachieving again. Everyone said he couldn't hit these quotas with that number of employees, but look what he's doing. And then every year by Christmas time, my customers are disappointed and I'm like, well, what do you want from me? All my guys are hurt. Like, what do you want for Like, well, I don't know. Adjust. Adjust. I respect him as a coach. He's obviously an excellent coach. He needs to tweak this one thing, man. There is Every coach would get love to play their best that. players all the minutes. Say it again. Do they, get, do, they, do they get there without him playing the players the way he does? But I guess my point is, what is there? Do they get to round two? <laughs> Yeah, maybe. Like, this is like, this was not a, you know, a historic run. And I like the Knicks. But you, the, the, this whole thing of, and we saw it with the, we've seen it throughout his career. And so I just, I just chill a little bit, bro. Especially when if I, you, you you wouldn't play Alec the Burks Josh unless you had family funny. members kidnapped, and then you finally play him, and Alec Burks is like, I'm all right. I might miss a few defensive rotations, but I, I I'll help you out. Like, it's just too much.
Hey, thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button to get more from the show and make sure to click the bell to get notified every time new content drops. Check out full episodes of What's Right wherever you get your podcasts or just click the link in the description below.